attention, all you trick-or-treaters. It's time to get your ghoul on. For tonight is All Hallows' Eve, my favorite time of the year. Our little town really comes alive on October 31st, when witches and devils, imps and monsters roam our town. Holiday activities begin, the streets are filled with all kinds of creatures of the night. Some wear masks to disguise their dark intentions, while others choose to hide in plain sight. So warning to those of you collecting your treats and filling your bellies, keep your wits about you. And don't forget to check your candy. See. Seriously, Mikey, you better save some for Sweet Tooth. Who's Sweet Tooth? About 50 years ago, Timothy Blake lived on this very street. Timmy loved Halloween. He loved to dress up. Most of all, he loved trick or treating. But. He was always sad when he had to go home. That's the best part. That's when he get to eat all the candy. Not for Timmy. See, Timmy's parents were really strict. They would let him go out trick-or-treating, but they never let him eat any of the candy. Said eating candy would make him fat and lazy and rot his teeth. Go 
Go to your room, son. Why let him go trick-or-treating, then, if he couldn't have any candy? What did they do with it all? That's exactly what Timmy wanted to know. So on Halloween, Timmy snuck downstairs to find out. first piece of candy. He was hooked. He ate every last piece his parents had it. But what? He wanted more. But there wasn't any left. Yes, there was. No way. Timmy ate all the candy he could find inside his parents, but... What? He wanted more. Now, every Halloween, every single Halloween since, his evil spirit comes back, trick-or-treating. If you don't share your candy with him, he will come and take it. All of it. Even the candy you've already eaten. Anything to satisfy his sweet tooth. Is it true what Kyle said? It was just a story, Mikey. He was just trying to scare you. He's a douchebag. <laughs> Get some sleep. Celebrating? I think Mikey almost shit his pants. <laughs> Thanks for the assist. We'll be lucky if he gets any sleep tonight. I think we might have taken it too far. Well, come on, Liz. Sweet Tooth Story is a Halloween tradition. Every kid in town falls for it. It's like a rite of passage. I know, but you didn't have to be such a... An awesome guy. A douchebag. <laughs> <laughs> his words, not mine. Peace offering?
Oh my god, I can't believe we ate it all. I feel sick. <sighs> Where are you going? I'm going to get some Pepto before we both get sick. <sighs> Better hurry. You know we are gonna have to get more candy. Oh, don't say the C word. Mikey's parents will be home soon. Kyle. Kyle. And we're dressed like assholes. I can talk you into anything I want dressed like this. Gross! I'm right here. Nah, your sister took your costume, bud. I'm even breathing that thing. It's 100 fucking degrees outside. You get used okay, to it. Okay, leave him alone, Todd. He likes his dorky outfit. Oh my god! Billy! I'm an idiot. I totally forgot to ask. Did your mother dress up this year? What? Is your mother in a slutty costume like your sister? Hey! What? You remember your mom brought you to school in that Catwoman outfit one year. We still talk about it. Such a pig. Can't we just go trick-or-treating? Is he special? It's not even dark yet. Plus, I think it's time you do Halloween like the big kids do. Todd, don't. Do we have to do this every year? Do what? Pranks. Do the tricks and get the treats. With us, tonight. <sighs> Billy, you love candy, right? Yeah. And you also love Halloween. I know you do, because you're dressed like a retarded six-year-old from Leave it to Beaver. No offense. <laughs> But you know who doesn't love Halloween? Your next door neighbor. He has to watch you spaz out every year. And does he even put up any decorations or leave the lights on or leave out a bowl of candy? No way. Why would we egg anyone? Why do you think kids tag his house every year? I mean, it's been going on for as long as I can remember. It's a Halloween tradition. It kind of is. I actually started when I was about your age, too. 
Plus, if you don't, I will tell everyone that you pissed your pants. But I don't think. No one else will know that. Captain Piss Pants. Billy, Captain Piss Pants. Billy, Captain Piss Pants. But I don't pee my pants. Really? Fine. Go up there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my God! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nice costume. I didn't... I mean... I had no idea! No idea that what? That you terrible children have been destroying my home for years? He said they told me it was a Halloween tradition to pray. Ah! Young man, tonight you are going to learn what a real Halloween prank is. By the way, Billy, is your mother dressing up again this year? Hmm. Candy rots your teeth. Can't have that, can we? Don't forget the floss. What an asshole. Happy Halloween!
how many Twitter followers you have? 500,000? 500,000? And one. to untie our guest. Yeah. What? I thought you were going to show me what a real Halloween print was. Oh, I believe I did. And I believe you'll find some visitors at your home. Why don't you just run along now, little boy? You know, your mother's going to have a lot more free time on her hands now. I just want you to know that I plan to be here for her. Awesome, huh? <laughs> You're disgusting. Shh, there's a movie on. This year. It's like every other kid's got an eye patch. Maybe they're all missing eyes. You're so bad. Bunch of gimpy kids with peg legs and patches. Give me some candy. <laughs> this is <just> stupid. <laughs> Your turn. Man. Let's go. Fine, fine, fine. Stop it. Fine. They're coming for you. Look, there comes one of them now. He'll hear you. Can you say trick or treat? Hey there, princess. What do you say? Huh? Oh, that a girl. Mm -hmm. Hey, uh, you want some rum and cider? No, thanks. Cheers. Mine already, huh? Ah, uh, it's a witch. Awesome. <laughs> Trick or treat. Nelson, you're drunk. She's supposed to say that. <laughs> Tell me. Trick or treat.
god! Oh my fucking god! Where's the car? What the fuck happened? Oh my god! What? What is it? Maria, she. Halloween, you fucking sick. <laughs> Now here's a tale for all you hood rats over there across town, on the wrong side of the tracks. Keep your heads up and your butts down, cause the weak need all the help they can get when the wicked come out to ride on All Hallows Eve. Sheriff.
Show me Piggy's trotters. Please. Alice, please, 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 please. Alice, please. Alice, guys, hang on. Hang on. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. I know you, stranger. Spills the blood of the wicked, where the wicked have harmed the weak. I think you turned yourself into a monster with that soup boy.
They didn't do nothing to you. Hold him down. When the word is carved in flesh, the call is sent. Return them Hush to the location mouth. of their offense! Hush up! You know, it's kind of poetic, really. You. Know. Us. Together. On all hell's eight! Ain't no monsters here. Just me. Spirits roam the earth tonight. Do you know why we wear costumes on Halloween? It's so the dead won't know who's alive. <laughs> Their night, and while some of them like mingling with the living, there are others who don't like to be seen at all. There's one ghost who hates it more than any of the others. Mary Bailey was laughed at her whole life. She died being bullied and unloved, all because she had a disfigured face. But now it's her turn to have the last laugh. She comes back every Halloween to taunt the living and to laugh at them behind their backs. So, just a word of warning tonight. If you find yourself alone on the way back and you hear an evil cackle and footsteps behind you, I will you turn around because if she finds you looking when you least expect it, she's gonna take your eyes. <laughs> chance to make you jump. God bless them. You're all in on it, huh? <laughs> well, we can resist. You scare so easily. You're lucky it's Halloween. <laughs> Cheers, oh. my baby. <laughs> Let's have a drink. <laughs> Are you good to drive? Oh, yeah. I'm not that far, and I'm not that drunk. What are you... Oh... Are you still driving that piece of crap? I love that Tonight. piece of crap. Oh, bye, guys. Lovely party. Thank bye. you. <laughs> mm. Oh, man. All right, well, thank you for coming to the Halloween party. Oh, come on. I know how much this means to you. Well, all right. Mm. Mm, good night, man. Drive safe. I will. Oop. See you before next year. Yeah.
Duh. A song to get you to the other side of the witching hour. Just turn around now. Turn and you'll see. I'll be behind you eternally. You're never alone. I'm with you wherever you go. <gasps>
baby. Where are you going? children out there. It's not fair. I know, honey. But look. Trick or treat. What are you doing, Jack? I don't know. I thought... Dressing our dog up like Rapunzel would make me forget that we don't have a child. Gretel. She's supposed to be Gretel. You know? Like Hansel and Gretel? to be. Witch and the devil. Alien. Oh, you are, are you? Well, pleasantries aside, I assume you have a candy. Yeah. yeah. Good. Hansel here has lots of candy, but we've been using it to fatten him up. <laughs> so I can eat him, just like I ate his little sister, Gretel. Yeah. So she could hear herself be eaten. <laughs> uh, would you like some of my candies? <laughs> Maybe we should call it a night. You know, go to bed early. Forget about all this. Why do you make me do it? I don't mean to. Oh, 
Aren't they just so darn cute? I could just eat them up. I'm gonna make cookies. <laughs> And we just don't even know it. Back to the sidewalk to help you look for your mother. It's okay, you want to come inside? It's safe in there. Is this one yours? Toby. They told you not to run away like that. I shouldn't have kids. <laughs> the things you do to me, the way you hurt me, I couldn't let you do that to a child. I saw a doctor, and he made it so that I couldn't give you one. I'm sorry. <laughs>
Who dares disturb the sleep of the dead? I'm guessing you guys. What the hell? That's, That's enough. enough. He's a little bit more black of one. What? Hey, Dr. Cadaverino! How you doing? Would you turn the music down? What? I'm sorry, it's a little loud out here. I would like you to turn the music down. Oh! I'd like to help you out, but it's fucking Halloween, you know? My favorite holiday. It's a sacred holiday. Exactly. You get it, right? Look at you with that whole undead doctor Knott's Frosty thing you got going on. <laughs> you really threw down with that, man. Look, you knew. I have been doing this display exactly as is for the past 20 years. <laughs> yeah. We can tell. Would you please turn the music down? And you, it's after dark. Close the dairy. What the fuck off, old man? Whoa, dude, monster up. Don't be such a party pooper. This is what's beautiful. This is what's been lost because of you. And this. I like what you did over there, man. You're like a cute little kitty show. <laughs> it's like a spooky daycare. Oh, oh, that's the spirit! Oh, and then I go! Hey, asshole! Of course you realize this means war. No! Don't do it! Perk up this candy ass display! Some motherfucking blood! No! in olden days.
days on this night, it was believed that the veil between our world and the spirit world was at its thinnest. So be careful. However terrifying you might think you look, there's always something worse lurking out there. And on Halloween, nothing is what it seems. <laughs>
Pick or tweet. Are you kids still up? Or are you tucked away in bed? The night isn't over, and you're far from safe. So here's a little something to keep you company. Mask. Oh, why do I gotta be the princess? Because we have two masks, and I sure as shit ain't going to the princess. Here he comes. You ready? Imagine what it's like if your daddy is a millionaire. I'm just dead. <laughs> I'm looking to spoil a little brat. Robbing banks is one thing. I don't know about kidnapping. Oh my god, seriously, Dutch, please don't give me that more bullshit. We're not gonna hurt him. And Rex Enterprises is gonna handle a measly ransom, believe me. You know, if we're gonna do this. Our window, it's right now. We're never getting a better opportunity. All right, shut up. Just, just shut up. Let's just do this. <laughs> Let's just do this. All right. Sugar, Mom. Get lost. Hello, kid. Don't scream, don't run. We won't hurt you. I'm not here to steal your fucking candy, kid. Say that was that's pretty easy. No, oh, why wouldn't it be? It's a solid plan, not for the fun part. Hey kid, you've done really good so far. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna call your daddy. And if he has to talk to you, uh, I need you to say uh, hi, daddy. Um, I'm fine. Okay, got it. Hey. Mr. Rex, we have your son. If you ever want to see him alive again, you're going to do exactly as I say. You have Rusty? That's right. For five million Benjamins, you get your precious Rusty back. You've made a terrible mistake. <laughs> you're in no position to make threats, Mr. Rex. You poor bastard. You have no idea what you've done. No, I think I have. Hello. Uh, what the fuck did he just hang up with me? Call him back. Hello. Um, why did you hang up on me? Because we're negotiating the release of your son, Mr. Rex. Not interested. Do not call this number again. Okay, listen to me. I'm not playing around with you. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Block the door. Block the door. Come on out, kid. I'm gonna count to five. And if your little punk ass doesn't come out, you're gonna be all kinds of sorry. One. Two. 
Three. Four. All right, here we go. Okay, I'll... 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 Viciously assaulted by a monster, dude. What kind of what kind of a monster cries like that? I'm just gonna check on him. I'm just gonna check on him. We'll never speak of this again. One, it's fucking humiliating. Two, I don't believe it. I was fucking there. All right, great. Let's just pretend like it never happened. What the hell? What? What is it? I'm begging you, please, just take him back. He's your problem now. No, oh, come on, man, just name your price anything you want, please. Don't you get it? I'm finally free. It showed up five years ago on Halloween night, trick or treating, and would not leave. Okay, so let me ask you a question. Why the hell did you pretend like it was your son, man? What are you thinking? He's not your son. He's not your son. We've been held hostage this whole time. What the? He'll never let you go, ever. <laughs> By the way, Make sure you feed him, or he will eat. Oh! I was gonna eat! Oh, that's great! Thanks, you're an asshole! We drive till the sun comes up, and then we just drive a lot more. Fuck this town, fuck everybody. 
for kidnapping, bro. Right? Yeah, amen to that, man. Sorry, Princess, no strawberry shakes. Ta-da! I give you my masterpiece. <laughs> yeah, it's not bad. All right, now come on. I have to get ready for the party. No, I just gotta clean up in here. Hurry up. Okay. Got. It's a nasty one. Uh, apparently, the husband got his head bitten clean off. Bitten by what? I don't know. An animal, maybe? The wife's pretty shook up, but she's inside with the sketch artist. Jeez. Oh, Reminds me of the case of the man who stuck his head in a blender. Talk about making a meal of it. Has Forensic Bob seen this? He's all over it. Where's the wife? She's through here. Oh. Ma'am, my name's Detective McNally, and I want to assure you I will do everything within my power to bring this killer to justice. <laughs> Detective, you don't have the slightest idea what you're dealing with. This has to be a nightmare, because what I saw in there is... It's not possible. <laughs> All right, what have we got? You're not going to believe this. Try me. Nice work, Rembrandt. How am I supposed to put out an APB on a pumpkin? Detective? Yeah. Captain wants to see you down at the station. For me, Kevin. Hey, do not go knocking on strangers' doors until I'm there. Do you hear me? Yes, Mom.
shut the door. Shut the door. Sit in the fucking chair. Rough day? I don't know. What do you think? What's wrong with this fucking picture? It's Halloween, sir. Bullshit. Bullshit. Every year on Halloween, this town goes batshit crazy. I mean, check these reports out. We've got hysterical blindness. We got neighbors attacking neighbors. Kids looting convenience stores. There's even a fucking report of a UFO. I mean, this is bullshit, McNally. You're just the man to fix this. Just get your butt out there and do the work. Because if you don't, I'm going to boot you back to vice so fast, your head's going to spin. Understood, Captain. I'm on it. Good. Good. Go bag me some of those horror freaks. Oh, what the hell happened to you guys? Some crazy kid ate a shitload of chocolate. Yeah. And then he ate his babysitters. Hell of a night. Hell of a mess. McCallie, check this out. So, I measured bite marks on the victim's body, and this is the thing. Whatever bit that guy's head off had a mouth about this wide. Yeah, I think of a few suspects. Yeah, but then I ran the data through the computer to make a 3D model, and this is what it came up with. Look familiar? Nice work, Bob. I owe you one. Buy me a drink later? No, think about it. I gotta go. Greetings, ghouls. Twelve bells means the witching hour is upon us. That's when the weird, crazy, scary scale goes totally off the charts. So lock your doors and hold on to your candy. Because Halloween is about to get real. Dispatch McNally, we got a 1034 in Union and Baker. Fire and medical on route. I don't know what's going on down there, but it sounds like a total clusterfuck. Did you copy? I'm on my way. You might need a hand. Guess I owe you that drink now. We have a warrant to search your premises. Look, I'm in the middle of some important work here. You can't just barge. Yes, I can. I wouldn't argue with her. She's not in the mood. I guess you should come in. So, uh, Milo, 
Show me where you grow these super pumpkins. <laughs> I can't just give away company secrets to anybody who walks through the door. Get some lights on. Quit stalling, my. Oh, boy. Holy shit. What's the big deal? Just a bunch of pumpkins. The witching hour is over. Thanks for listening. And until next year, happy Halloween. Let's